welcome back. So today's video is going to be my Sephora Playbox unboxing for April 2017. This is a $10 a month subscription box and this month's theme is Step It Up. So stellar products are only the beginning. What is, why Step It Up? I don't know, I'm trying to take your beauty to the next level I guess. So it comes with a little pamphlet thingy that tells you about each of the products and why they're special. Um, this box is $10 a month from Sephora.com. You sign up and then every month they ship it to you and bill it to you. I usually get mine around the 15th to like the 25th of the month. It really just depends. Um, this month the bag looks like this. It's basically like a little pouchy thing with a drawstring. And the text says, the best things in life are me. The girl with like a crown on her head. <laughs> kind of silly. I did already look through this box. I find that that helps me keep this video really short every month rather than me having to be like, what is this? And then reading about it and stuff. Maybe you guys like the element of surprise. You want me to be like surprised when I'm un when I'm unboxing for you, but I don't know. I kind of like having everything open so that I can tell you my opinions. All right. So the first thing I see, there's always one perfume sample in the box and this is the Miu Miu. I think that's how you say it. M-I-U, M-I-U, Le Bleu um, perfume. Um, and th this is out of the blue, Mew Mew. The fresh floral fragrance consists of lily of the valley and notes of honeysuckle to evoke the beginning of springtime. So, I think it smells pretty good, pretty springy. Um, I also got a sample of the, it's one ounce, Purity 3-in-1 um, Cleanser for Face and Eyes by Philosophy. I mean, it's really small, one ounce, but this could be really good for travel. Or like for when I'm in the hospital and having my baby. When you're watching this, I'm like 36, 37 weeks pregnant. So I will definitely be needing that soon. Um, I have this Sephora waterproof eye makeup remover with cornstarch, cornflower extract. Um, it's like a blue waterproof eye makeup remover. So you could use that like on a cotton pad. Um, also, a Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer, it's oil-free. I was a little bummed about this because they always seem to give this stupid primer away as a freebie. And I got the full size because I like it. Like, I do like it, so I now have the full size and I have a primer sample of it, which is fine. But I just thought that was funny that I can't seem to, like, when I want the free sample, they don't give it to me, then I buy the full size and then they give me the free sample. Go figure. There's just two more products in the box. There are just two more products in the box. Um, one of them is the Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Hyaluronic Cloud Cream. It says hydration for up to 72 hours. So it's like a moisturizer. This I was the, probably the most excited about, which is odd to be excited about something that's hydrating, but I am so dry. It says it's a lightweight moisturizer with airy formula that delivers a burst of hydration with three different types of hyaluronic acid. Um, I'm not sure if you can have hyaluronic acid when you're pregnant, so I might hang on to that for after, but maybe you can. I just better not. Last but not least, this is um, a tiny little box. I'll tell you what it is. Makeup Forever Aqua XL Eye Pencil. This is the shade M10. Basically, it's a mini black eyeliner by Makeup Forever. Um, and this is um, creamy, budge-proof eyeliner that glides on easily and leaves intense jet black color. So I have a lot of black eyeliners, so I might give this away, but I do really like the Makeup Forever eye pencils. I think they're really good. So all in all, ten dollars. That are those are six, yeah, five makeup -y products, makeup and skincare, and then one perfume or six samples for ten dollars. So everything is about what did I say, a dollar seventy-five or not quite two dollars. Um. Alexa, what is 10 divided by 6? 10 divided by 6 is 1.67. Okay, so every item in this box, if you count the perfume as an equal item, is $1.67. So would I have paid $1.67 for this moisturizer? Sure. Would I have paid $1.67 for this primer? Probably not. Would I have paid $1.67 for the perfume? Probably not. So you guys get the idea. Like, sometimes I think it's worth it and sometimes I don't. I would have really liked to see more makeup instead of, like, skincare and stuff. Um, sometimes they put in a hair care product. I would have liked to have seen a lip product or a blush or something like that, a powder product. They just really don't do a lot of that because they have to be cautious that everybody has different coloring and what's flattering on their skin color might differ and they don't take a lot of time to customize these boxes. They just have some random products. So I mean like a waterproof eye makeup remover, anybody can use that. But I'm really like more into my makeup wipes these days. It's good to have one on hand but I might re-gift. So do I think this month was worth it for $10? 
Not really, honestly. I still, every month, come with the idea of, like, I'm going to cancel, but I don't. <laughs> Do you guys like seeing this video every month? Would you be sad if I canceled and stopped um, filming this for you guys every month? Let me know down below. And if you got the Sephora Play Box, let me know if you got anything different than I did and what you thought of the box. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Click the little bell to be notified when I put out a new video. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.